fitness warriors this is Romy the mighty Singh Gill in this episode I'm going to show you how to make a quick five minute meal we're always in a rush we always have things to do and we don't have much time to cook our meals in this episode I'm going to show you how to eat a healthy meal in less than five minutes let's go I'm going to show you everything from beginning to end and let's see how long it takes so I'm going to go to the, go to the fridge and get all the food I need so we got some cottage cheese, some tomatoes, cucumber, some broccoli and some baby carrots. <clears throat> Let's get some thing to chop my vegetables with. Everything we need here. Whenever you're eating your vegetables, no matter how fresh they are, make sure you wash them. So I'm going to get something to wash these with. Put everything in. You have to be a little careful about carrots. And normally carrots spike your insulin levels. So try not to go too crazy over these. Just have no more than 10 pieces, that's a good measure. So I'm going to count 10. There we go. Put the rest away here. Let's wash the cutting board as well. Now we're ready for action. Just take your vegetables. Whatever you need, it's okay. You don't have to eat a lot of vegetables. Just as much as you need for flavor, it's good. As you can see, I'm not really good at cutting. And then you can chop it into small pieces. I normally keep it simple because when you put it in your mouth, it's going to dissolve anyway. So everything kind of ends up in this bowl. Same thing with tomatoes. Nice and simple. I'm sure you can probably do a better job at cutting. I mostly see my food as fuel so I don't really have to make it too fancy but if you're making it for your guest you can make it fancy. So I'm going to keep my broccoli and my carrots separate because I'm going to mix the rest with my cottage cheese here. And you can also boil these vegetables. I like to eat raw because I prefer it that way, but if you like to boil it or steam it, that's also fine. So I'm gonna have about this much. And again, you can chop it into smaller pieces, or if you like me, you can eat it just like that. So here we have this ready. You can have this in a separate bowl. Eat it on the side. So we have this. I'm going to push this over to the side. Now the fun part begins. Cottage cheese. Now most vegetarian people don't have many options for vegetable vegetarian food so just kind of pour it on so we got some veggies here so to pour it on top we have about 66 grams of protein in here but 
depending on your size, you can have half of this carton or one third. So 22 grams should be a minimum you should be eating. If you're looking to gain muscle, you need to eat more protein. If you just want to be healthy, you can have less. And now on top of this, you can add whatever flavor you want to add. So try not to add too many sauces. I usually add hot sauce to it. It doesn't have too much uh, bad nutrients in it. It just makes it spicy, easier to eat. And spicy food also makes you sweat, so increases your body temperature and eventually it causes thermogenesis, which means it burns calories. So that's all it takes. Now you can mix it up and if you like you can also add a, any other spices or any other flavor to it. Some people like to add lemon to it, that's also okay. Here we have a perfectly healthy meal ready to go in less than 5 minutes. Thank you.